We want to welcome every single one of you to the anointing water prayer line in the United States. Prophet T.B. Joshua has given us the anointing water to pray for people, to pray for their salvation of their souls, for healing, for deliverance and breakthrough in their lives. Anointing water is nothing but water, but yet it's special because the anointing of Jesus Christ is upon it. We know that water doesn't heal, but it's anointing of Jesus Christ. It's the name of Jesus that brings healing. So there, therefore for all of you that are on the prayer line awaiting to receive prayer, lift your eyes to Jesus. Like in, uh, in the wilderness when Israelites were bitten by snakes, the key was not to look at their bite, but the key was to look at the serpent that was raised. For all of us here today, the key is not to look at our troubles, our sickness, our problems that we're facing. The key is to look at Jesus that's lifted up on the cross. The key is to look at the finished work of Jesus Christ and expect an answer because He has said, it is finished. So let's open up in prayer. and uh, Let's open up this prayer, uh, prayer line with prayer. Say, Lord Jesus, open up my heart to your word. Say, Lord Jesus, open my heart to your faith say Lord Jesus open my heart to your spirit now get ready to receive Right now the anointing water prayer line in the United States has begun and we encourage every single person that is here today to remain in an attitude of faith as the evangelists continue to pray with the medium of the anointing water. We know that God can express himself in any medium, through any medium and right now what you're witnessing is the power of God moving in the spirit through the medium of the anointing water as the evangelists continue to pray in Jesus name. Clean spirit, fire of the Holy Ghost in Jesus' name. Fire of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. All over your body right now. Fire of the Holy Ghost. Fire in the name of Jesus. Fire. Fire. Fire in Jesus' mighty name. What have you done to this woman? You unclean spirit. What have you done to this woman? Speak out in Jesus' name. What have you done to her health? What have you done to her? You unclean spirit, speak out. What have you done to this woman? What have you done to her? What have you done to her? Fire in the name of Jesus Christ, all over your body. Fire in the name of Jesus Christ, all over your body. Fire in Jesus' mighty name. Every unclean spirit, out in the name of Jesus Christ. Out of this body in the name of Jesus. Out of this body in Jesus' mighty name. Every, every, out of every part of this body. Out in Jesus' mighty name. 
Why do you want to kill her? How did you enter her? How did you enter her? You unclean spirit. How did you enter her? She was initiated! How was she initiated? Speak out. How was she initiated? You unclean spirit. What have you done to her? What have you done to her? What have you done to her? I torment her! I torment her! What have you done to her? I help? torment her children! I torment the family! I torment them! I torment them! What have, you, what have you done to our relationships? What have you done to our relationships? You unclean spirit. What have you done to our relationships? Speak out in Jesus' name. No. What else have you done to this woman? I destroyed her family. I destroyed them. They're in my hands. Each one of them. What did you do specifically? What did you do specifically to the family? Separated all of them. Separated all of them? Yes. Did this girl? Is this your wife? Friend? What are you going to do? Did you enter? How did you enter her? Speak out. How did you enter this woman? Why should I explain myself to you? You unclean spirits, speak out. Why, how did you enter this no, woman? No, I will not speak out. What are you going to do? You want to save them? What do you want to do? You made the greatest mistake of coming into this place. I knew she was coming here. She keeps praying with prophet Timmy Joshua every single time. She keeps praying with him. And the Messiah loves this girl. And Why you... does he want to save this girl? Why not? Why? I want to. The Messiah wants to use this girl. What do you want to do against to bring her? Bring light to the family. And, and you don't like that, huh? Ask her the last time she saw her mother. Ask her the last time she saw her brother. The the Queen Spirit, you have made the greatest mistake of coming into this place. And that I mistake is you today your I end has come him? and right now you in the know name I her daughter I sent someone she was sitting out there outside her house I sent a woman to come and take her to my agent and who is that agent My agent initiated her. Then I wanted her daughter. You wanted her daughter? A nine year old daughter is mine. She is the not. The father of the yours. daughter initiated her. This woman does not belong to you, and you made the greatest yes, mistake of letting her come what into this I place. Fire in Jesus' mighty name. Fire in Jesus' mighty name. Fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Out of every part of her body right now. Come out in Jesus' name. Out. Out in Jesus' name. Out in Jesus' name. Out in Jesus' mighty name. This woman doesn't belong to you right now. Out of every part of her body. Out in Jesus' name. Out in Jesus' mighty name. Out in Jesus' mighty name. Come out of this woman. By the blood of Jesus Christ. Out in Jesus' name. Out of this woman right now, you demon, in the name of Jesus Christ, out of every part of her body right now. Out in Jesus' name. 
out in Jesus mighty name blood of Jesus Christ fire of the Holy Ghost fire of the Holy Ghost fire in Jesus name fire in Jesus mighty name out in Jesus mighty name this body is not your temple right now come out of her in Jesus name come out of her in Jesus mighty name this is not your house stop this nonsense come out of this body right now come out of this body come out of this body in Jesus name come out of this body come out of this body come out of this come out of this body out 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 leave her right now out of her in Jesus name come out of her in Jesus name come out of her right now in the name of Jesus Christ fire of the Holy Ghost in Jesus mighty name all over your body from the top of your head this is your day of torment demons come out in Jesus name come out of her come out of her right now come out of her right now out out in Jesus mighty name out of every part of this body out in Jesus mighty name your time has expired fire in Jesus mighty name 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 all over your body right now fire of the Holy Ghost in Jesus mighty name fire of the Holy Ghost in Jesus mighty name come out of this body come out of this body right now come out of this body right now loose her loose her right now in the name of Jesus Christ loose her you unclean spirit all over your body right now fire of God on your hands fire of God on your feet fire of God in the name of Jesus Christ fire out in Jesus name if you don't want this fire out leave her right now go where you belong in Jesus name come out of her come out of her you unclean spirit come out of her right now come out of her right now this body is the temple of the Holy Ghost out out in Jesus name out out loose her right now out out in Jesus mighty name out in Jesus mighty name in the name of Jesus Christ and don't ever come into her once again in the name of Jesus because of Christ be free in Jesus name because of Christ be healed in Jesus name because of Christ be delivered in Jesus mighty name madam can you stand to your feet please can you stand up please madam do you know what was happening to you you were hitting everybody here come here come here what is your name what is your name what is your name again? Susan. Susan. Did you know what was happening to you in the last 10 minutes? No? How you were saying that you were initiated and all of these things that were happening to you and that you wanted to destroy your family? I came to pray for my family. So all of these things that were spoken, it was an evil spirit that was tormenting your family, was tormenting your life. And today because of Jesus, this evil spirit is gone and you are free in Jesus' mighty name. <laughs> Say thank you, thank Jesus. You, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. I'm free. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. And church, as, as you saw, our pastor was saying earlier today, how demons' main mission in this world is to destroy people. They wanted to kill people. And they, they hate when we rescue people and when we help people. And that's why we need to learn from that more and more. That Satan came to still kill and destroy. But our assignment is to help people, free people and to save people through Jesus' name. Amen. Let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ. What you just witnessed right now was the real, authentic, and forceful power of God in action today through the medium of the anointing water. And we know that where the light of God is, truly no darkness can prevail. Darkness has no hiding place here in the arena of liberty. So we encourage you all here today, as you're in the congregation, if you are watching online, to connect yourself in faith because you too can be a partaker of this divine movement of what God is doing right now through the medium of the anointing water. So stretch your hand forth and begin to receive your own miracle, your own blessing, your own breakthrough in Jesus' mighty name.
You can see right now this woman is not at ease with herself as she receives that touch from the Holy Spirit through the medium of the anointing water. What did you do? I give her pain in here, yes. Where did you give her pain? Yes. Where did you give her pain? Look, pain across. In the hip? Yes. Yes. What else did you do in her life? Yes, I destroy her. You destroyed yes. what? Yes. Her family. Her family? <laughs> How did you destroy her family? How did you destroy her family? Fighting. Fighting? I make him to fight. You make them fight? Yes. What did you do with their finances? What did you do with their finances? Their careers? Answer right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Evil spirit, your, your time has expired. And right now in the mighty name of Jesus, I command you. Loose her right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every pain, every suffering, every setback in the mighty name of Jesus. Every generational curse. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come on church, let's stretch our hands and let's begin to command the spirit to come out. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out in the mighty name of Jesus. Every darkness, we command you. Out in the mighty name of Jesus. Out in the mighty name of Jesus. Loose her. Loose her right now. Loose her body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose her family right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Loose her in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose her in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire all over her body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We declare you free in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Ma'am, can you stand up? And what is your name? Azib. Azib? Yeah. Were you the one to say that you gave, <laughs> you, get, you make, you make uh, your family to fight? No. No? Were you the one to say that you caused the pain in your hip? Don't know. No, you don't know? You don't know? Have you been experiencing pain? In your body? Oh, yeah. Where? Right here? Yeah. We believe that the cause of the pain was the evil spirit. And now that it's been cast out, oh. you are free in Jesus' name. Yes. Say thank, thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. Those of us that have been in the prayer line, please, uh, please get back in the prayer line. Yeah. And let's make the faith declaration. Say, I am saved. Jesus is my Savior. Say, I am healed. Jesus is my healer. Say, I am delivered. Jesus is my deliverer. Say, defeat and failure is not my portion. Say, I am justified. I am no longer condemned in the name of Jesus. Now walk in the light of your testimony. You are free in Jesus' name. Continue to be in an attitude of faith right now as the second prayer line continues to commence. So right now, just connect yourself in faith because faith is the heavenly currency. We know that without faith, it is impossible to please God. And those who come to him must believe that he is and that he is the rewarder of those who diligently seek him. So right now, we're going to get started with our second prayer line of the day in Jesus' name. We welcome everyone once again to the prayer line with the anointing water in the USA. You're welcome in Jesus name. Uh, Prophet T.B. Joshua has prayed for this water and has dedicated this to be used for praying for people with needs. We know that it's not the water that heals but Jesus for the healing is done in his name. And the Bible says that when we look to Jesus that we will never be disappointed. And Jesus is the one that will bring healing, restoration and breakthrough in our life. And you are here in the prayer line today so that your spiritual condition can change. Physical condition will change 
when the spiritual condition will change that the curses that the chains you're carrying from your generations maybe that affect your health or affect your finances they will be broken today in Jesus name amen and so receive that as you're going to receive the touch of the anointing water it's just the contact and when the woman with the issue of blood touched Jesus's garment it was just a garment but because of the anointing and her faith that touch alone resulted in the fact that the one that the issue she had for 12 years completely ended and God is going to put an end to those issues today when you come in contact with God's anointing in Jesus name amen could you pray this prayer together with us say Lord Jesus open my heart to your word Lord Jesus open my heart to your spirit and Lord Jesus open my heart to your faith in Jesus name receive in Jesus name amen Remember that God cannot be limited by time or space. So distance is not a barrier to the move of the Holy Spirit. And anywhere you are, you too can receive and be a partaker of this divine healing, deliverance, and blessing that is happening right here in the anointing water prayer line in the United States. So don't let your faith be limited, but rather ask God to open the eyes of your faith. Because when the eyes of our faith is opened, it is the silencing of our fears. And as we come to God, we know that we can receive from him because he is a good, good father. And he is ready to give you his good and perfect gift in Jesus' name. The gift of healing, the gift of deliverance, the gift of salvation this morning in Jesus' name. Right now you can see the name Jesus working in the spirit through the medium of the anointing water as the evangelist continues to pray for each person here today who have come here from far and wide to receive a heavenly touch, the touch from the Holy Spirit to change their situation from darkness to light, from yoke to deliverance, from sickness to good health, from a faithless generation to a faithful generation in Jesus' name. And this morning we encourage you to connect yourself in faith because truly faith is the transformative power of the universe. It is the power of change to change your situation this morning. So get connected by faith today. Reach forth and receive your touch from Jesus Christ. You can see right now this young woman is not at ease with herself as she is receiving that touch from the Holy Spirit, removing and uprooting every single agent of darkness that has caused her any calamity in her life in Jesus' name. We know that where the light of God is truly, no darkness can prevail. And what you're witnessing is a battle right now, a combat between light and darkness. But we know that the light of God can overpower and uproot every single agent of darkness in Jesus' name.
name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Church, let's just stretch our hands and we're going to continue to pray. Yeah, as you're sitting there, you're participating with your faith and with your prayer. Be praying under your breath. You're not a spectator, you're a participator. People's lives are hanging in balance. And so let's continue to pray. Continue to pray in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every trace of darkness, right now we command it to lose its grip in Jesus' mighty name. Every trace of darkness right now, to lose its grip in the name of Jesus Christ. To lose its grip right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. To loose its grip in Jesus' mighty name. To loose its grip in the name of Jesus. Out of this body. Out of this body in the name of Jesus. Right now. Out of this body in the name of Jesus. Out of this body in the name of Jesus. Out of this body in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now. Out of this body in the name of Jesus. Right now. Every thing. Every servant. All of that. Come out in Jesus' mighty name. Come out in Jesus' mighty name. Come out in the name of Jesus. Come out in the name of Jesus. Come out in the name of Jesus. Lucifer it now 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 in the name of Jesus Christ. Lucifer it now in Jesus' mighty name. Every single chain, every single chain of the enemy right now. We speak. Let it loose it now in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, right now. Holy Spirit, fire. All over your body. All over your body right now. All over your body. One by one, let it come out right now. Come out right now in the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Loose her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus. Come out of her with the name of Jesus Christ. Come out of her with the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name. The fire of the Holy Spirit right now. Touch her from the top of her head to the soles of her feet. In Jesus' mighty name. Holy Spirit, right now, let your peace come. Holy Spirit, let your light come anywhere without its darkness. In Jesus' mighty name. And every trace of darkness right now to loose its grip. In Jesus' mighty name. Every trace of darkness to loose its grip right now. In the name of Jesus. Anywhere where there was darkness, let there be light of God right now. Anywhere where there was darkness, let there be light of God. In Jesus' mighty name. Light of God in every area in the name of Jesus. This is the temple of the Holy Ghost right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Light of God to come right now in Jesus' mighty name. Light of God to come right now in Jesus' mighty name. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now we commit her body, we commit her soul at her hand. Light that she will in Jesus' mighty name. Darkness right now. Oh, in the mighty name of Jesus. 
standing, those of us who are standing in the line right now, I want us to say out loud after us, just keep standing where you're standing, say, I am saved. Jesus is my savior. Say, I am healed. Jesus is my healer. I am delivered. Jesus is my deliverer. My past is over. I am justified. I am redeemed. I am no longer condemned. Defeat and failure are things of the past. I'm a new creation. My past is over and I will go.